Our annual Food for the Holidays drive is going on right now at today's TMJ4. Yep, you can drop your donations off right here at the station or call into our phone bank. Lance Allen is standing outside in the cold because, you know, it's back to December like temperatures today. Get you in the giving spirit, right, Lance? <laughs> Definitely, Bridget and Vince. Yeah, it's absolutely a beautiful day. I know the last couple of days it was a little bit warmer, but it's still a great day to get out there, food for the holidays, and donate early and often today. Our first donation of the day, Pentair, Kathleen Fugler, welcome. Thank you. Thanks for having me. And let's check out this donation yes. and what's going on here. Holy smokes. Look at that. 78, mm -hmm. 16. Feeding America, Eastern Wisconsin. Yeah. Absolutely great. Uh, thank, you. thank you very much. Uh, Kathleen, and first and foremost, Pantera, what is it? So we are actually a manufacturer of parts and components for water systems. So our um, boss likes to joke around that you're never more than 30 feet away from a Pentair part, whether it's water softener, filtration, or any other treatment solution. So. And why is this near and dear to Pentair to help food for the holidays, sure. food for the hungry? So for us, as one of the larger employers of water professionals in Milwaukee, we feel like this just really touches our mission because we like to make a difference in people's lives, whether it's through our technologies and solutions, or if it's through our corporate social responsibility efforts, like giving back through food drives. We do Toys for Tots, volunteer efforts during the year. So we always like to make sure we're making a difference in the community. And do you notice that the workers and everybody in the company really gets behind this? They really get kind of jazzed up for this? Absolutely. Actually, uh, this was a result of our food and fun drive that was a competition between our Brookfield and Glendale locations. So we had little weekly updates as to who was winning and although I work at the Glendale office, I have to give kudos, Brookfield did win. Nice. So they had uh, they collected more food and money on their end, but it's all for a great cause and good fun. All right, Kathleen, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and thank you for helping Food for the Holidays. Yes, thank you very much. All right, Kathleen Fugger joining us from Pent Air right here, first donation of the day. Plenty more to come. Please stop by the station. And if you can't stop by the station, we have the phone bank up and running. 414-967. It is 54. I got to double check that number, 5417, just to make sure I give you the right number. 967-5417. So please call at any point until 7 o'clock. Vince, Bridget, back to you. All right, Lance, thanks for that. I was over at Feeding America this morning talking to yeah. them about this. And they say our food drive is so important because they seek to raise a million meals every year. And so we're right, obviously, at the end of the year right now. And usually, Crunch everybody, time. you know, pitches in, we, we get over that limit, so. Mm. Crunch time right now though, right? Yes, and yeah. And that was 7,800 meals right there. And bring the kids and the food out later on this afternoon. I know a lot of the racing sausages and yeah. bring <laughs> It gets better than just Lance out there. <laughs> true, true. <laughs> Lots of photo ops. All right, yeah, I got them back. Exactly. <laughs>